Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to Flashing Lights. For those of you joining me for the first time ever, my name is Sabatsum. For those of you returning to the channel for another series, I'd like to welcome you back. Now, Flashing Lights is uh, something pretty unique that came across my desk. It is essentially a early access game where you can either play as uh, EMS, uh, the police department, the fire department, and you kind of go about uh, saving lives, solving crimes, doing stuff like that. The game is very early access, a little buggy, and and there's not a whole lot to it just yet, but I thought it'd be pretty cool to check out. Reminds me a lot of, if any of you are familiar with things like uh, Arma 3 or Arma, Alt, uh, Arma Life, stuff like that, where you can uh, play as like a police officer and stuff and arrest people. It's a lot like that, I think. Um, you can see I'm online right now. Actually, I'm playing on an online server, so everybody's kind of working together to uh, do certain things like uh, respond to accidents, uh, fires, stuff like that. I don't think that there is a whole lot in the game yet. I've noticed that there's a, a, not, a lot of the same events are coming up, but we'll, we'll see what it has to offer anyway. So I'll play as uh, one of each of the three ro roles over the course of the next three episodes, and we'll check out each role. We're starting right now with the emergency medical services, otherwise known as the EMS. So I'm an EMS operator, and I'm actually inside of an ambulance right now. I can get out of the ambulance. This is my character here. It's a little uh, buggy. People seem to be enjoying it, though, actually. The... Uh, like hour or so that I was playing by myself, um, not recording, uh, a lot of people came and gone in this server. There's been a lot of high traffic, actually, so I do think that people are enjoying the game and are, are having a lot of fun with it. There's a lot of cool different things you can do with the vehicle here. We'll actually start it up. You've got uh, lights that you can turn on and off. You've got uh, a, lights with a siren. And then you've actually got blinkers, just in case you, you need them. Um, you can switch your camera mode there. You can turn on your four ways or your hazard lights and uh, all sorts of different stuff. So I think this game kind of is, it's a definitely more of a role playing game. Obviously you're, you know, you're going to role play your character and you're going to kind of follow traffic laws and stuff like that. That's kind of why there's the blinkers. That's kind of why you play. Now, right now, we haven't gotten any missions. Over on the left upper corner of the screen, you can see that's where our reputation points are as well as how many people we've hospitalized. And that's also on the left side of the screen where your missions are going to come up. And then we can pull the map up and actually see the full map. The map is very uncompleted. There's still a lot of stuff that needs to be added. Um, so right now, all we basically have is, is the town, and then uh, the stuff happens on the kind of outside area of the town. And that's basically about it. We can see actually there's a police officer up here. He's maybe shooting radar or something. Uh, I think when you play the single player version of the game, you, know, you do end up getting a lot more moving traffic and stuff. It seems to be on multiplayer. Uh, none of the uh, traffic seems to really be moving much other than the online traffic here but and that car is parked on the sidewalk so that police officer should probably give him a ticket but he doesn't seem to know where he wants to go even though the the fire is literally right there so I guess since we're the first on scene we'll respond Now, the fire trucks have not made it yet, but that's okay. We're first responders. And we could probably help out. Um, the police officer's not sure if he wants to help or not yet. He hasn't figured it out. Um, let's see. We should have a fire extinguisher. There it is. I don't know if a fire extinguisher could put this fire out. I guess I'm going to be the firefighter today. We're getting reputation points for putting it out. Okay, the fire department's showing up. Okay, I <laughs> they they can handle it now. I it's a little bit out of my out of my league. 
But I figure since I was the first one in the area, I may as well have responded. So we'll put our fire extinguisher back. We'll see how these guys handle the fire. Oh, yeah, they've got a little bit more capability for it. Yeah, so the game's kind of all about going around and role-playing stuff, you know? People are chatting. As you can see, they're going out and responding. A lot of the incidents sometimes require multiple forms of, you know, vehicles and stuff like that. People get injured or there's like a multi-vehicle accident. You got to have the police involved so they can file a report, stuff like that. I think the firefighters got the, uh, they've got this out of, or out, under control. <laughs> Maybe out of control. They've got it under control so we can... We can get out of here. All right, we're just gonna go ahead and head through because they're they're all responding now. They don't need me. There's nobody there injured. Oh, and if you bump into a vehicle, you get you lose a little bit of reputation. So putting out that fire kind of canceled itself out, anyways. Probably should be using my blinker here. I don't want to get a ticket. I'm probably going to break a lot of traffic laws. The vehicle controls are a little clunky. Definitely hard to navigate with them. Uh, EMT and the police are way out there for some reason. Okay, there's a police officer coming this way. Okay, I'm not sure what he's responding to. I guess we can go check it out. Maybe they need our assistance for something. Just looks like a big police gang bang. Not really sure what's happening over here. Oh, they seem to be arresting somebody. Oh, they're even putting cones out. Well, this is very exciting. Oh. oh he's closing the road off, so I should probably get out of here. He's... I think he's pulling me over for something. Or I'm in the way. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> Uh, I can explain, officer. <laughs> Who put that sign there? <laughs> oh, great. I'm in trouble now. <laughs> He's running my license. <laughs> Wait, hold on. I'm not really sure where my... Oh, God, I just stepped out of the vehicle. Uh, hi, you know why I pulled you over? <laughs> uh, uh, I'm trying to remember how to type. I actually don't know. I thought it was just enter. Um, <laughs> uh, let me check real quick. <laughs> Hold on, officer. I got to remember how to type. I need backup on traffic stop. Uh, fires out on... Uh, I'm trying to find out how to talk. I, I found it earlier and I've, I've seemed to have lost it. Um, although I saw what he said there, but I at least need to need to know this <laughs> chat is T. I knew that. I knew that. Oh, he's arresting me. He's going to pull me out of the car. Okay. <laughs> Is there a problem, officer? <laughs> uh, I don't know why I'm having so much fun with this. <laughs> oh, Jesus. I'm being arrested. Well, it's been nice. <laughs> I, I, even as the EMS, I mean, the cops don't have enough people to arrest, so they got to arrest me. I think he said he needed my help with something. He wanted me to follow him, but 
then he decided he'd much rather just arrest me <laughs> me in the cop car he needs me for something I think <laughs> he's probably bringing me to jail for uh for running over that park no parking sign which by the way I think I left my ambulance in a no parking zone whoa that was an excellent stop oh my god Jesus Christ. So he crashed into the building and uh, laid on his horn. <laughs> if you crash, press escape. Help commands place vehicle in front of you. I think he's trying to role play that he crashed. Yo, I am dying. Oh, I, I'm dying too, man. Get, get out of the vehicle. I can't pull this guy out. I guess I'll, ch <laughs> I'll just get back in. So I got in this guy's by police department. So I got inside this guy's vehicle <laughs> and he crashes into a room for rent place. He's role playing that he's dying. There's a vehicle. I've never seen that vehicle over there. That's bizarre. Oh my God. I've got a vehicle incident. I need to respond to sir. Officer. I can't be here. I have a vehicle incident. I have to respond to. I got to get back to my ambulance. I'm running. I'm running on foot. He'll probably eventually leave once nobody plays along. Yeah, he just said, I'm okay. I mean, he changed his mind. Now he's going to probably come hunt me down. And I wanted to use the opportunity to escape. I really want to respond to that vehicle incident, but now I don't have an ambulance because he uh, pulled me out of Well, he arrested me, essentially. What the heck is that? I did not know that there was police vans in this game. It's very cool. Is that my ambulance right there marked on the map? I think it is. It looks like about the area where I ran over that sign. I think everybody's waiting for calls right now. That guy just said stop PD. I'm pretty sure he's trying to arrest me. Again. He's very upset about that park, no parking sign. Yeah, right there's my ambulance, just chilling. God, that guy's heading my way. All right, we're gonna find out where this vehicle incident is so we can show up and help. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> He's got his taser out. He's shooting me with the taser. <laughs> I for I'm going to respond to this call. He oh, Jesus. Sir, I am responding to a call. I cannot be arrested right now. I'm trying to save somebody's life who is very far away, mind you. I can't run over traffic lights. This isn't Grand Theft Auto. All right, this call calls actually pretty far. We're going to have to get on the highway. Okay, his vehicle's very That's one thing I will say about this game. The vehicle controls are fairly clunky. Oh, well, we got to get on the highway. Oh, that guy that was trying to arrest me left the game. Well, that makes me feel a little bit better. All right, we're going to be the first ones on scene to this, I think. I will say on the multiplayer version, it doesn't look like there's any NPC traffic, but in single player, there is NPC traffic. So just something to keep in mind. You can actually do things as a police officer like 
uh, shoot radar and stuff like that. Those guys are waiting for a call as I respond to this vehicle incident. Now if we actually turn this guy in, then we'll get uh, some points for our reputation. I haven't figured out what the reputation points do yet. I don't know if you can unlock stuff or what, because when I was actually looking at these screens for like building your character and equipping your character, there wasn't a whole lot there, so I think that maybe some of it can be locked. Okay, we're going to want to slow down. Oh my god, every time you hit a traffic sign. Ah, right there it is. Looks like a tow truck has beat us there, and a police officer's already beat us here. And they're... Alright, we're here. Let's turn our sirens off because they're a little annoying. We'll keep the lights on though because we're responding. Okay, we've got a person here. They don't look uh, very responsive. Oh my goodness. Use a med bag from the trunk to inspect the person. Alright, we gotta move. Med bag. Uh, probably in items? Yes, medic bag. Okay. Alright, what do we got here? Body inspected. Oh, this gives us reputation points. Had a lot, too. Frisk the suspect to find stolen items. <laughs> I think this is the wrong one. Okay, okay, we're... Okay, we've, we're done with the inspection. We need to get her to the hospital. I guess she's in rough condition or something. So we need to grab the stretcher. There we go. This is very, very difficult to control. Do I just run it into her? <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's not how you do it. up there we go okay it took a little bit you'd be surprised how hard it is to just pick somebody up um, the fire department's responding to a cat stuck in a tree so that's always really beneficial for the community meanwhile I'm over here trying to save lives Fred says fuck the mugging let's go help that pussy <laughs> oh my god all right we gotta oh I Jesus Christ I forgot to shut the back doors Kind of EMT or EMSMI. Okay. All right, here we go. All right, good job, boys. I'm taking this person out of here. And I believe it or not, I think I've memorized the way back. Players are responding to an officer needs assistance, which we could potentially respond to. The nice thing is you can respond to other people's calls, so obviously if they need help with something, uh, you can respond to their calls and give them a hand. Luckily vehicles don't break down or we'd have a big problem. All right, we can turn the siren off. I'm doing 88 on the highway. 89 now. 90, 91, nice. What if I just pulled the e-brake? Nothing. But if you pull the e-brake and turn, you'll drift. It's a little tricky to get down. I was doing it with the cop car earlier. Oh, wait. We're still going.
And we're going to drop this person off. We should get reputation points. I believe you get a pretty good amount of reputation points for doing this. We're almost to the hospital now. I actually don't know where to bring them. But I would say right here looks about right. Oof. Yeah, it looks like it's it. This <laughs> jinxer says, get the cat. I'll cut the tree to save any future incidents. Prevention is key. Oh, God. Wait, hold on. I think I just grabbed. No, I have to actually. There she is. All right, ma'am, here we go. Oh, somebody responding to a vehicle fire. No way. All right, perfect. And so that completes that there. We actually will get the points here in a second, hopefully. Yeah, there we go. 45 points. That's actually a lot. And two hospitalized. Very good. Yeah, so obviously uh, there's not a whole lot there just yet, but I, you know, the potential's there. It's pretty cool. And if you like role-playing games and such and emergency service games, then this is definitely something worth checking out. Um, but we're not over yet. We tried the EMS, and uh, next we'll try uh, either the firefighter or the, the police department. And we'll see what that's all about. But we're over for this episode. So I want to thank you all for joining me. I do hope that you've enjoyed it. I look forward to seeing you next time. <laughs>